guys welcome today we are going to paint the game hold on hold on hold on where are your brushes here uh at and it didn't go for my red at dead of night uh this game is a walking simulator where you are playing these girls who come to a hotel uh ho hotel so when she comes into this hotel basically uh she realizes that something is wrong because the guy at the reception is is being really creepy and um, so she wakes up in the middle of the night it is really late uh and she wakes up and then she realizes this this reception guy is drugging one of the guests um and then the game starts and she is going to have to walk around the hotel uh, using a, a kind of device called the spirit box that looks like it said go, but it, I, I meant this is supposed to be like a spirit box. Um, and she's using the spirit box um, to basically contact the, the ghosts that are in the... Uh, in the hotel and then the ghosts tell her what happened there and, and she's gonna have to figure out what happened to the ghosts and then they're gonna have discussion back and forth she's gonna find items uh, i don't know what item i just drew that was just a circle with some weird stuff on top but like she's gonna find items like a baseball bat she's gonna find like a gun um sort of things like that that this gun is gonna have a scope haha -ha. It didn't have that in, in the game, but I, I just had to draw it. <laughs> so basically, yeah, she's going to find all of these items and she's going to talk to the ghosts and say that, oh, well, I find this one. Can you give me information about it? They're going to give her some information about it. And then they're going to, you know, have discussion back and forth and trying to figure out what the fuck happened at the hotel. Um, the thing is, meanwhile, all of this is happening. This guy, the reception guy, Jimmy, will chase you. So he's going to try to get to you and like try to smack you and kill you, uh, which means that you continuously have to move around and you will have to kind of find safe areas and you're going to have to, you know, do a lot of things to, to make sure that Jimmy doesn't catch you. Um, and then basically, yeah, that's that's what you're going to have to do. You're, you're trying to look through that talk to the ghost, find out what happened, avoid Jimmy, and then just try to, um, try to get away. Um, I gave this game a 5 out of 10. Uh, the good part is, I, I wanted to do like a, a thumbs up. This is my way of drawing a hand with a thumbs up. It looks like one, right? Um, yeah, so the thumbs up is is that it was the story is good. Uh, I like the um, yeah the story was good. <laughs> I can't remember what what of the, the uh, what what are the things that I brought up during my review, but the story was really really good. There was a lot of of fun parts. It was really exciting. It, it was kind of fun to to have to walk around this hotel and have this like I, I don't think I mentioned graphics at all when I was reviewing it because it was very. I felt like it was very, very nicely done because it was kind of like a, a, a movie slash game. So I, that was, I, I like that kind of way of, of having it. Um, the bad part is, okay, so this is going to be my bad part. The negative part was that there was bugs. Uh, it was slow. Um, yeah, I think the bugs and the slowness was the, the things that weighed it down quite a lot. Um because it, there was so much waiting time so many times or not so many times but there was a few times where cutscenes didn't trigger and whatnot which kind of made it quite frustrating uh, because this one there was especially one time when i was running around back and forth i had to restart the game several times to try to fig uh, to trigger this cutscene i did actually googled it because I was running around for so long, had no idea what I was doing. And then it just said, I'll go to these, this place. And then, then I did that like several times from different angles and nothing happened. Um, so yeah, the, the, it was kind of a frustrating. So I would say 50-50 because it is an exciting, an exciting game because Jimmy is continuously chasing you. Uh, the story is interesting because you're talking to these different ghosts and you're learning about what actually happened at the hotel. Um, and then on top of that, 
it is kind of slow. There's a lot of dead time. Um, some of the dead times I feel like is okay because it makes sense to have that dead time. Like when, when you're hiding in a room and Jimmy's there, that makes, that makes sense. That's fun. It's still exciting because he's running around. But then there's also these situations where it is a lot of, of waiting time when it comes to going through the different floors waiting for the elevator and and things like that so it, there's a lot of things that are still kind of not perfect um, and it kind of unfortunately drags down the score of the game but in general would I recommend it or not well kind of and that's why I gave 5 out of 10, because I kind of would want to recommend it. But I also feel like there's a lot of frustrations in the game. So, yeah. But but it's okay. I feel like it is okay. An okay game, uh, definitely. Um, but yeah, thank you so much for watching. And I'll see you next time. Bye! Thank you so much for watching my video. I really do appreciate that. And as usual, we're going to end up with a very awkward dance. I'll see you. Bye!